recently Michael Jackson's moved into this neighborhood. We've brought him some bread and salt because I live right around the corner. It's a traditional way of saying welcome to the neighborhood. Let's see if we can, uh, let's see if we can. 100 grand a month he pays for this joint. Rent it. Hey, how are you? How are you? Oh my God, this whole Michael Jackson thing. We got bread and salt for him. Hey, how come he still, got, you, his, how come he still got his Christmas decorations Because up? it looks hot. <laughs> Look at this endless parade of people all coming by on a rainy day to see Michael Jackson's front gate. Now, I got to tell you, when he first moved in here, he didn't have that black canvas up, although he did have the Christmas decorations up. That was a recent addition. People just come out here from all over the world and just hang out here in their cars. Uh, over the Christmas holiday, I talked to someone. They were visiting from Italy, and they had been here for 10 days in their car. I said, did you see them? They said, no. They said, we saw them once. I said, when? She said, two years ago. I said, you do this all the time? She said, yes. Let's see if anybody's there. I don't think it's connected, but you can understand why if you're Michael Jackson. Because if we turn the camera around, you'll see this crowd of people on even a rainy day here in Los Angeles just hanging out, waiting to see if he comes out. So, Linda, you run Starflight out here. At, you've been out here at this location at Carrollwood and Sunset for quite a while. Yes, and Michael I have. moved where you were selling maps, is that right? That's right. And it's so amazing because I supported the trial. I knew it was an extortion plot from day one. An extortion plot, the original <laughs> trial. Now, uh -huh. what's been going on out here the whole time you've been out here? You've been out here a long time with Michael living here. What's it like? It's really exciting because a lot of fans from all over the world are actually coming out and he's actually autographing stuff. The guards are taking it in. He's autographing stuff. He the is. Fans are really sweet. Yeah. So we have a variety here of different people. And, but they, one thing in common, they have good taste in entertainers. Michael saved the world in a lot of different ways, in a big way. So four SUVs, they come out at the same time to make a right, to make a left. So unless he wants to get a picture snapped, he's not going to. We're going to go around to his back gate and see if we get somebody to take our, our welcome to the neighborhood salt and bread. How hot. Michael Jackson's rear gate. Let's see. Rear gate. Yeah, hi, this is Tom Gregory. I'm a neighbor. I'd like to welcome Ms. Michael Jackson and the kids to the neighborhood. Uh, is this where Michael Jackson lives here, correct? Well, and he just I moved in. you have a camera. What's the camera for? I'm with OV Guide, and about uh, two months ago, we broke a story in Beverly Hills about a rash of Christmas, tree, uh, Christmas decoration robberies. So I also was wondering if you knew why Mr. Jackson, it's, it's very late January, still has his Christmas decorations up. Blanket really likes Christmas. In February? Blanket really likes Christmas. You know what? Someone will be out for your bread. Uh, thank you. Well, we didn't get in to see the King of Pop, but he did take our bread and salt. So I guess he's going to be a good neighbor. Let's just hope he takes down those Christmas decorations before the 4th of July. For OV Guy, this is Tom Gregory. Remember, it's what's on the web.